the biology of the human is well studied. But the organ's abilities continue to surprise even the experts. Adults can no longer see their entire reality and there are kids who dive with dolphin-like vision. Humans can also see the invisible or get tricked by their own eyes to miss something visible right in front of them. Here are top 5 bizarre abilities of human vision. The number 5 is, the blind have more nightmares. Can the blind see in their dreams? Yes, but only when they lost their sight was later in life. Interestingly, people who are born blind also have nightmares but experience them as emotions, sounds, and sensations, rather than anything visual. A recent study roped in volunteers in three groups to learn more about dreams. The first was born blind, the second turned blind, and the final group had normal vision. Anxiety can trigger nightmares, but none of the participants had more jitters than the rest. Despite this, there was a major difference. The majority of nightmares showed up when the sight impaired went to sleep. The blind from birth group had the most, around 25% of their dreams, while those who became blind underwent a curious decline. The longer they were blind, the fewer visuals appeared in their nightmares. However, the rate at which they had unpleasant dreams remained more frequent than the volunteers who could see. The study supported the theory that nightmares are linked to waking experiences. After all, when a person must navigate society in total darkness, they live with a higher awareness of threats and feelings of vulnerability. The number four is, babies notice everything. Infants see reality in its entirety while adults no longer do. Grown-ups literally lose the ability to notice all the details in their visual field, but there is a good reason for that. Seeing every line, crack and hair will result in sensory overload. Babies need to see everything because their world is new and their brains are still figuring out what is important and what to ignore. In 2016, Japanese scientists showed babies photos of snails. A previous study had confirmed that infants stare for longer at new things and the snail-wielding scientists relied on that fact to determine whether children can see differences no longer obvious to adults. The photographs looked similar to the adult volunteers but the researchers knew which ones held subtle differences, and the rugrats found them. This was most obvious with those aged between 3 and 4 months old. However, the freaky supervision seems to disappear between the ages of 5 and 8 months. By then, the newborn brain has realized that some things can be shelved and other details, like mom's face, are more important. The number 3 is, motion-induced blindness. The human eye is like a camera with a slow shutter. As a result, moving objects sometimes trail streaks across our vision. The brain's attempt to protect us from annoying streamers led to something called motion-induced blindness. For the most part, this phenomenon erases the lines. But it also causes stationary objects behind the moving ones to vanish. As a species, humans evolved to notice moving things. Predators and prey had to be seen in order to survive and neither stood still. For this reason, scientists believe that motion-induced blindness helps to see whatever is moving with clarity, rubbing out the streaks that interfere with perception while also blotting out the things that do not move, nor matter, at that moment. The number two is, we can see infrared light. Open any science textbook and it will tell you that humans cannot see certain wavelengths. These include radio waves, x-rays, ultraviolet and infrared light. As it turns out, the books are outdated. In 2014, it became clear that people can detect infrared light. Scientists were alerted to the fact after several of their colleagues reported seeing green flashes while working with infrared lasers. These look nothing like the lasers in action movies or pointers in boardrooms. Infrared lasers are supposed to be invisible. In order to unravel the surprising possibility of seeing things in the invisible spectrum, an international team descended upon the eye cells of mice and humans. During the tests that followed, they zapped different parts with pulses of infrared light. The results showed something incredible. The human retina detects this wavelength when hit with a particularly strong dose of infrared energy. The concentrated light particles lengthen the retina's visual spectrum and this allows the human eye to temporarily see into the invisible range. The number one is, the eye sees patterns the brain cannot detect. At first blush, one would think that the eyeball can never be better than the brain. 
After all, eyes exist only to see while gray matter has many abilities. However, our blinkers beat the brain in one way, and it surprised even the experts. Enter ghost images. These pictures are encoded as random patterns in other images. Only computers had the ability to pick up on their presence, or so everyone thought. In 2018, the complicated calculations required to identify the ghost images turned up in the human eye. Where the brain fails to see these individual patterns, the eye detects them, gathers the information and sums everything up. This might not sound so incredible until you realize the complicated nature of ghost images. Making one is similar to taking a photograph in reverse. A laser then hits and reads multiple spots on the surface to reconstruct the image. Similarly, the eye registers the light points bouncing off a ghost image and use them to pull a picture together. I'm confident that you enjoyed my video if you did, subscribe my channel and like the video thanks for watching.